Welcome to Mediocre Gaming, and today we're playing Hull Divers 2. Well, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. I'm Zero. Let's get to it. So today we're talking about the secrets of Hull Divers 2, but before we get to that, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, smash that subscribe button, and ring that bell to be notified of all future episodes as soon as they go live. So let's get into it. First tip. All boosters are shared between Helldivers, so as long as one person has it, you all benefit from it. That's a gimme. In addition to that, ship modules always travel with you. So depending, it doesn't matter who's hosting, you always get those upgrades that you've paid for. Next up, except for the backpack and support weapons, everything is shared between Helldivers so it doesn't matter who picks it up as long as someone picks it up. These include samples, war bonds, requisition slips, and super credits. So as long as one person picks it up, you all get to share it. Now with the samples, you do have to extract with it. Otherwise you don't get it. And if you die, you drop it. Next up, depending on how long you're in a mission and how many monster generators there are it will get more hectic so if you're in a 40 minute match or mission and it takes you 40 minutes before you get out it's going to be more hectic there's going to be more bugs or bots in the mission additionally if there are more monster generators so nests or outposts it will likewise get more hectic when you're trying to get out so try to do the mission quickly but also thoroughly and take out those generators as well as finishing the mission quickly. Those things will help you out. So if you're having problems where you're getting overrun and extraction, this will help you. Next up, super samples or super uranium is consolidated in one spot on the map in every mission. You're going to look for this rock that's jutting up that kind of looks like it's covered in spider webs and all of the super samples are going to be there so you either get all the super samples or none of the super samples now depending on the mission there may be a couple of spots where there is a rock that looks like this but only one of them will have the super samples next up we have weapon options Holding down the reload button, which is square on PlayStation, will bring up different options for your weapon. So semi-automatic, automatic, rate of fire, flashlight, as well as possible scopes, depending on what the weapon is. So you have different options. In addition, you can also fire it in third person or first person by hitting R3 or the respective button on your PC. All right, next up. And probably one of the most important ones is that items can be shared between hell divers. So go to your backpack button, whatever that is, that's down on the D pad, hold that down. And that accesses that you can drop your backpack, you can drop your support weapon and you can drop samples. So if you're trying to help someone out, someone goes down, they had a support weapon and or backpack. You can pick that up. If you don't already have one, travel to some place where it's safe bring them back in and then drop those items for them and then they can pick those up. Now as an honorable mention, it is a, a bug. It's not really a secret. If you have the vitality booster during a mission and someone drowns in the water, they will enter a broken state. They'll have a sliver of health, but they'll be in all respects dead in the mission and they won't come back unless someone comes over there and shoots them and then brings them back. Well, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to check us out on social media and thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And we'll see you next time. Minus one minute. Bugs, southeast. Reload. Going down a set. Reloading.
ンション。